everybody, happy October. Today we are going to be doing a fall outfit video. And it's not just any like fall outfit idea video, it's particularly my favorite fall thrift finds. The majority of my wardrobe is thrifted. I like having like unique fashion, I kind of have an eye for those things that I like when I go to the thrift store, so I love the thrift store. So I thought it'd be great to do a fall outfit video using pieces that are from the thrift store. All right, so for this look, I wanted kind of a whimsy witch goth, whimsy goth. So this maxi skirt is from the thrift store. And it's got these really cool like swirly designs on it. So it makes it look a little more like whimsical. I'm wearing my Dolce Vita slouchy boots. I have a pair of tights underneath. Um, this cover up I got at Urban Outfitters, this black one, it's kind of like that 90s vibe. And then just like a corset underneath. The necklace is from the thrift store. It was kind of like this inspiration behind the outfit. I wanted this long necklace to like layer up choker and then the matching, my matching Luna Moth earrings. So it's giving Botanical Witch, the green purse to give it a pop of color. So I got this jacket at the thrift store a while ago. It's just like this paisley jacket. I feel like this was some someone's grandma that they used to wear to like church jacket or something, but I feel like I made it like, I don't know, it gave me like 70s vibes, so I liked that. This skirt, it's actually a skort. So this is a skort, it's from um, Delia's. So it's like a throwback to early 2000s. I really love it, it's a skort, so yes, it looks like a mini skirt but it's a mini skirt, squirt. This is like a long sleeve crop top Henley that is from Urban Outfitters. And then I've got my Doc Martin Leona boots. So this would be a fall outfit in a not so cold fall day, like a 60s fall day, you know? Also, I am wearing nude tights, so it's hard to tell because they're close to the color of my skin, but they're tights, so my legs are actually kept a little warm. You can wear, you know, thicker tights depending on how cold it is. And then just throw the jacket on top. Another one of my thrift finds, I got this little like leather bag, which I thought would be just cute with this outfit. I got these pants yesterday and they weren't a thrift store find, but they were a Ross find. These are free people flare pants that I got for $8.99. These are like over $100 pants at least. And they fit me perfectly. They were like my size. The only thing is they're super long. I, I folded them down right now. I have to hem them, but they were like a double zero because that's my size and they're super long. I'm like, were these like a sample size for the model? Because they, they were so long. So I paired these Free People pants, and they're like a brown, high-waisted pant with like gold paisley and gold button accents. I, I can't believe I found these at Ross. I'm obsessed. And then I got my docks on, 
and I added this thrift store top. So I got this top at the thrift store. I'm really into like ruffle tops lately. I feel like they add like a little layer of like, I don't know, vintage, also like boho because that's my vibe. And I decided to use it as like a little, like not button, but just like a cover up for the texture and the color. So I have this fall top that I, um, I don't remember where this is from. This could be a thrift store find too. I don't remember, but it's just, um, orange. It's just orange with maple leaves or it's orange with like autumn leaves on it. So definitely the vibe. I think it goes well with the pants because they both got that print. And then I paired it with this, um, green velvet bag. I like the velvet texture. I like the color combination. So this is that outfit. Oh, and then for accessories, right now I just put this little locket that I have. Cause I thought that, I don't know, it kind of gave me like I'm going to the bookstore vibes. They fit so well. They these they have like of course they're free people so they're expensive, but they're those jeans that like they actually are tight on the waist. They don't have like a gap from your butt. I love that. This is just like a little black skirt. I got this white um, blouse at the thrift store. And then just sheer black tights and some loafers. Right, so if you wanted to make that outfit a little bit darker, I added this underbust corset. So this makes it a little more October, dark academia vibes kind of cinches in the waist. I can imagine wearing this going to my like witch school. So I make these daggers in art and I made a new Halloween collection. It is available on my Etsy shop right now. So I make these like daggers and wands and art. So pretty much like on my wall behind me, I made that piece. I have um, a piece over here that I made. So they are available right now. I also made some new artwork and I will show you that right now. A part of my Halloween collection, I made this mirror. I really, really love it. It is a black, ooh, it's a black mirror and then it has real dried flowers and um, quartz in it it also it can be hung or it can um or it stands so i have three new wooden artworks available so these are my original dagger artwork and I make the dagger and then I create it onto this wood um, slice. So this is a real wood slice. I love decorating my house very natural. I'm very inspired by like fantasy, um, video games, uh, Lord of the Rings. Just, I'm really into that kind of stuff. So these are what inspired these pieces. They are all backed in velvet for like a nice finish, a nice touch, so they don't like scratch whatever you're going to put them on. And then hung with a sawtooth hook. So they're all ready to be hung up on the wall. This one is named Maple, and it's like an orange and black, very Halloween vibes. 
this color of the dagger is like red and black. I kind of have that effect of like red dripping, very Halloween-y vibes. It kind of reminds me of a vampire. Once again, backed in velvet with a sawtooth hook ready to be hung. They are very shiny and like iridescent. It's hard to get that iridescent sheen on camera. So this is Dahlia. All right, so this piece's name is Elowin. For this one, I gave it kind of like, like when you open a geode and it's all those crystals or like a Druzy Quartz. I kind of had that effect for this one. It's really hard to get on camera here. So each spots are like, there's spots that are coming out of the wood that kind of reminds me of a geode. So this is Elowin. All right, so that's my Halloween collection. I have three pieces of these. I have the Enchanted Mirror and I have a Halloween Dagger. And if you shop now, you will definitely get it before Halloween. When you make an order, I ship out the next day. I'm straight to the post office. I get it all packed up. I put all the cute little goodies that I like to have in there and then it's ready to go. So if you were wanting to get somebody a Halloween gift or get something for yourself, you will get it by Halloween. All right, so I really love this dress. I got this dress at the thrift store, and this is actually a designer dress that's like handmade in Portugal. It's like hundreds of dollars, and I got it at the thrift store for, I'm sure, less than $10. I can't believe someone was giving this away. Oh, so I added this belt. This belt, it's actually just like this. So this is what it looks like. I added this because I wanted a darker vibe, but I thought it would look good with this. It kind of gives me like herbology witch. So I would wear this, I mean I'd wear it anytime, but this is really something I would like to wear like if I have something special like an event or like an art show or like something like that. I'm wearing these tights and these these are Dolce Vita slouchy boots. I thought they kind of gave me a Stevie Nicks vibe. All right, so for this outfit, this is my fall thrifted bag. I love the colors on it, it's just really fall. It's like a hobo bag, so it's really comfortable. I love this shirt. It's a Grateful Dead shirt with like pumpkins and shit. I love it. So it's an oversized tee. And then underneath I'm wearing this green, it's actually a skirt, so it has built-in shorts. I'm wearing this green skirt, so then it can kind of overhang. I have my fuzzy, sweater, black tights, and my docks. Oh, and also my little Betsy Johnson bat earrings. My little Halloween pumpkin patch outfit. So this is what I'm gonna go to the pumpkin patch in. My pumpkin patch outfit. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked the video, please give it a like and subscribe. I will see you guys all in my next video and happy almost Halloween.